Now that you have some more clarity about your major, the next step is to start exploring careers. I'm going to talk through three ways to explore your career options. I found that one of the best ways to do this is what's called an informational interview. Informational interviews are when you sit down and talk with someone who is working in the field that you're interested in. This is a great chance for you to reality check that job to see if it really is going to be a good fit for you. It's also an opportunity for you to ask the questions you care about versus reading information you might find online or in a book. Lastly, it's also a chance for you to meet people and hear about potential opportunities to intern, work, or volunteer in organizations or a similar organization. Do you remember that when Stella did an informational interview, she was offered an opportunity to volunteer? You're going to have an opportunity to complete an activity that will help you prepare for having a successful informational interview. And there are just four steps that you need to follow. Number one, create a list of people that work in areas you're interested in. Think about friends, family, friends of your family that work in things that you find interesting. If you're feeling stuck with this, ask an adult you trust if they can help you brainstorm additional people to talk to. Once you have that list, pick one of those people and contact them and ask for 20 to 30 minutes of their time. You can explain that you're in the process of exploring your career options and would love to learn more about what they do. When you meet, it's best to meet in person. However, if that's not possible, you could do the informational interview over the phone or email them the questions. The second step is to prepare a list of questions. It's very important that you write these down ahead of time and that you write down what they're telling you during the meeting. I recommend you prepare anywhere from five to 10 questions. You can see some of our ideas below, questions that will help you understand how they spend their time every day. One good question might be, what would you do if you weren't doing this? So you can find out more about what they do every day, what educational preparation they did, and any recommendations they have for you about learning more about this career path. Another thing to ask them for is for a referral. Do they have anyone else that they know that they could introduce you to that you could talk to? By asking for a referral, you're expanding your network and increasing your knowledge. The fourth step, and this is so important, send a thank you note. It's crucial to thank them for their time, their expertise, and if you're following up with any of the suggestions they offered during your conversation.